Okay, good morning everybody. I'm trying to get Val on FaceTime right now. And Megan is Oh, thank you. <laughs> Boomy butt. <laughs> right now I am here with Megan, first of all. And oh, I've got smile. I've got Val on FaceTime. Hi everybody! Because I just got something in the mail from Lucy Al's father and I'm very very curious as to what's in it so I'm going to open it and I have to get everybody here to figure out what it is. Let me see the box. It's just a... a it's a pony. <laughs> Okay, you ready? Ready! Use your teeth. Or your hands. Oh my gosh, that was so difficult. Oh! Did you see it? No, bring it, it down lower. It's a, it's a Viking boat from Iceland. Oh. Ah. That's for me, yes. And I guess that one's mine. Because hey. <laughs> you got a um, a stone pendant from Iceland. It says it's a oh. magic symbol, and it has. Oh, oh, that's pretty. And it is natural stone, and it has a design on it that it. Uh, I must. I don't know if it's. If it's Viking or what do they call the, the locals, the Inuits or something like that. But it's it, the, the symbol on the back is called Ost, A-S-T, which means love. Aww. Thank you, guys. Thanks, guys. There's something else in here. Oh, look. Happy fall to Kev, Val, Kevin, and Megan. <laughs> I bet you that's from Lucy. Yeah. And it says, enjoy the season and hoot. It's a picture of a drawing of an owl. I don't know if you could see the drawing. I can. And, there. and it says, dear Val, Kevin, and Megan, I'm so happy I met you guys. You're more than my friends. You're my family. And I can't wait to meet you. Love you guys. P.S. Give Bones a big hug for me. Lucy Owl. Love. Lucy Bones, it says. Well, thank you, Lucy. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Michael and Michelle and Lucy and Ellie. We love it. We're going to put the ship on our shelf unit in the living room, and of course I'm going to wear that pendant. I, I'm going to put it on uh, Daryl Voorhees right now. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, guys. See you later. It's Friday morning, and I am going to be working on the kitchen today. Megan is over at Nikki and John's. So I am preparing these walls for tile, and the first thing I wanted to do was to replace these switches because they are very, very old. I've got plenty of stuff stocked in the garage for this kind of thing. So I'm just going to have to find the right breaker, turn it off, and I'm looking for a pen right now so that I can mark it. Uh, I've been slowly marking all the breakers to so it makes this job easier. Hey everybody! Sorry for the way I look. I've been cleaning house all day. And cleaning carpets. I wanted to surprise my mother. But didn't quite work out that way. But what do you think of your carpets, Mom? I think they turned out very well. 
<laughs> house smells a lot better. <laughs> Not that it stunk before, but there was a little dog odor. So we took care of that. There was a lot of dog odor. You just don't have a good just, sniffer. Don't you tell people, yeah, I can't smell. <laughs> so how was your surgery? Surgery, I guess, was fine. I was knocked out, but the recovery is really bad. Yeah, pretty really painful. Bad. Extremely, extremely painful. Extremely. More yeah. painful now than before? Yes. And the pain is yet to come because I've got physical therapy coming over tomorrow and I'm going to have to start bending, walking. I've been doing that in the hospital, but not a lot. But now this guy's going to make me do a lot more than I don't want. And I'm, I went and decided to take my own bandages off at the hospital the other night and I got yelled at by my nurse. <laughs> And then I fixed, tried to fix them so the doctor wouldn't see what I was doing. And when the next nurse came on duty, she lifted up the covers to give me an ice pack. And she said, what in the God's name happened? And I told her I tried to take my bandages off because they were hurting me. And she said, oh, my God. I said, yeah. I said, Travis, the nurse didn't like it too much. He knocked me out after that because I was being a very bad patient. <laughs> You and Pa both, I, I tell you. Totally drugged. Okay, so I got the wiring done on this wall, and everything's working properly. For those of you who saw my electrical work from last time, don't worry, it's working. This is the my, the garbage disposal, and this is the lights above, and uh, we're lit up correctly over here. This is the actual um, outlet that caused all the problems in my wall over here and because I knew it was on a separate line however they shared a neutral wire there was apparently a fire in the neutral line which turned off all the lines over here so I was figuring this out and it turned out it was all over here and how I are you doing anything to eat yet tonight what how are you doing fine <laughs> glad to hear it <laughs> Get me warm in my pajamas all the time. Thank you for buying mom and dad a carpet cleaner. No problem. Thank you for cleaning it. They really needed it. And you know what? You fix your hair before you go on film. Look at what she's standing there in pajamas. Her hair looks nice. I know her hair looks nice, but still you are nice. Pretty as you pretty yourself up. I get up in the morning. I never is... pretty myself up. I took my hair out my of my hair sweaty is ponytail. On ends in the morning, and you say, "Oh, you look fine." Yeah. yeah. Okay. I go on film a lot without fixing myself up. She Trust does. me. Yes, she, she goes on film looking. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I do. I do. Potty mouth. I do. Potty mouth. Potty mouth. Bleep, Kevin. <laughs> beep, beep, Kevin. Next thing I want to do is I'm going to uh, prepare these walls to put tile on it. And I don't want to put the hardy backer on this side. Uh, only because it's going to raise the thickness of the wall here too much. And my uh, tiles are going to look funky. I also wanted to put tiles all the way up to the ceiling here. So um, I don't have to deal with different color paints and stuff. So the whole wall will be in tile. Now the funny thing is I've got this divot right here. And uh, I don't remember why that's there and I need to flatten that out um, to put tile on it and what I'm going to use is plaster of Paris because it dries rock hard and I don't have to worry about uh, drying time it dries pretty quickly um, uh, unlike the joint compound the joint compound is kind of soft and weak and I don't think the tile will um, stick to it that way after that's all dry I'm going to have to uh, put a uh, primer over it so it has something really solid to stick to. Primer should soak right into all the plaster and make it a, a pretty good surface. I don't have a lot to put up so I'm not worried about weight and, and so that way it's going to look really nice and I'll be able to do what I want to do. Okay so I filled my depressions, bumps and bruises with spackle. Um, that's plaster of Paris and I have to give it the day to dry and I need to sand and then I can paint tomorrow. And that means I can start tiling Sunday. Hello everybody! Hello! <laughs> I hope you all had a great day and let's check in and see how the lone wolf is feeling today. 
How you doing now, Pa? Yeah, you got some Z's early, though. <laughs> yeah, I did that go. That was good. That I was did, good. yeah. Yeah. But then I woke up grumpy. I'm doing all right, just a little, you know. A little blah. A little blah today, because I can't do much, so I was kind of like, you know, I can't do nothing really, not much. <laughs> It'll it'll be a, a little while, but you you'll get there. Yeah, I know, but you put you down, you know. Yeah, yeah. But you know, you got the Kindle, read, do play some games. You got that puzzle Megan sent you as soon as uh, yeah, the grandkids it's leave. It's hard for me sitting for a long period of time. Yeah. I'm gonna talk to Kevin because I got a really good memory foam cushion for my wheelchair. Yeah. That might work really good for you. It's got to be a good... It's thick. <laughs> it's thick. And it's really yeah. comfortable. Well, if it's back home, it ain't going to be no good. Well, he ordered it off of Amazon. We can order you one and have it shipped right here. Anyway, guys, Kevin's going to do closing tonight. I will catch you guys all tomorrow. Love ya. Bye. Okay, so that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you did. Um, if you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and please subscribe. I've got animals everywhere trying to get my attention, so I will see you all tomorrow, right? Right, Evie? Bye.